say that we started with a community on our own website. And what we've seen is people staying on our website for about six months and then moving on. So some of them just didn't want to hear about Risk Camps anymore, so um, wanted to leave the website. And we started to see them going to Facebook for the website. So actually, we need to be part of those conversations. We need to, to understand what's happening and we need to make sure that the community is not limited to our website. The first thing we did is we recruited a community and social media manager who was supposed to be here today, her name is Leah, but she's uh, either giving birth today or the next few days, so that's why I'm, I'm here instead. And what we did, we started by asking staff around the organization, not just now in city, we asked them what they were doing online. And we talked this morning about engagement and about how you find um, champions. So what we've discovered with the uh, survey, we discovered that most of our staff are on Facebook. And we discovered that some people were blogging in all the different departments. Some of them were using Twitter, but there was a question about, would you like to know more? And we found out that quite a few people didn't do any of those things, but were very, very eager to learn and wanted to do it. So those were the social media champions who decided to create this group of social media champions made up not just of people who knew how to do it, but people who really wanted to do it. So we issued some guidelines. So I have to be honest, the guidelines were not really for the social media champions. They were for senior, the senior management team. They needed this framework. They need to sign up some guidelines to make sure. Let's make sure we've got a framework. Let's make sure that people don't do any um, crazy things on, on Twitter, don't put a brand into this refuse. So we've got those, those guidelines, uh, which I can share with you. I used to give them a web with that, and I'll uh, give them in return for a nice tweet about uh, breast cancer care. So if you do that, I'll send you the, uh, the guidelines. And we work with HR to establish a training. Um, so we tell people how to tweet, but mostly about the tools and, and what tools you need to, 